I'm Brooke Taylor's son. My first encounter with Helen DeVos Children's Hospital was in 8th grade when my left lung collapsed. We didn't know what it was at first, so the specialist helped us, did some x-rays, and explained to us that uh, my lung just spontaneously collapses every once in a while. This has now happened five different times, resulting in two surgeries with uh, Helen DeVos's own Dr. Robertson. Uh, they've both gone successfully, but they can't guarantee that it won't happen again. But they've been very helpful through the process. Another time when Helen DeVos Children's Hospital helped me out was when I got diagnosed with a fairly new disease called eosinophilic esophagitis. Uh, this disease basically means that when I eat certain foods, my body attacks itself. Uh, they explained this to us and explained that not very many people have it and it's very rare. What this means is when I eat certain foods, my body attacks itself, making me unable to eat. Uh, throughout this process, I actually got down to 105 pounds. But how they fix this disease is figure out what triggers the food by eliminating foods until your system is clean. When they do that, all I could survive on was a special formula called Splash. Let me show you what it looks like. For senior year, this was my diet. This is all I could have 24-7, day in and day out for three months until I started getting foods back. After a few clean scopes, they've been able to reintroduce foods, and I'm now up to apples, pork, broccoli, chicken, corn, turkey, and potato. I couldn't have got where I am today without the help of Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. I've, throughout my medical issues, I've had the opportunity of using both the old building and the new building that was made possible by donations like yours. So if you're thinking about giving, I encourage you to do so, because you're helping out kids like me. And I thank you, and my mom thanks you.